Welcome to Keep Painting Those Miniatures. Today I'm painting Super Dungeon Explore Hero, the Angry Bear. I initially wanted this guy to be a panda like in Tropic Thunder. Sadly, the pointed ears made me think of a wolf rather than a bear. I compromised and made him a brown bear. I started by coating the fur with Minotaur bark. Followed up with a little bit of Reaper Woodland Brown over some of the raised areas in the fur to try and accent them. I felt a little confused with the model when I first started painting. A lot of people were using gold for the metal. Uh, I don't like a heap of gold, so I went with silver. I mean, painted gun metal for all the bits. I did a few cleanup passes on the trains to try and make them a little better. Uh, they had a little, little tucks and gaps to make them hard to you know, keep clean from all angles. I also picked out the band-aid, claws and nails with the white. The eyes and mouth were a little bland on the model for me, so I did them next. P3 men off white highlight for the eyes and uh, Reaper brand red for the mouth. I didn't feel like the hair tufts were standing out too well. Um, I went with P3 Menoth white base to mark them out, figuring the ink would darken them a bit.
As usual for my bases, I painted the Army Painter matte black and then followed up with a dry brush of P3 Minoth white highlight. I'm now inking the model with Army Paint of Soft Tone. This works really well with the Minotaur bark, uh, making it darker and working well with the other colours. I felt the eyes weren't angry enough, so I added a little Army Painter ink red tone to the eyes, teeth and claws. I regretted the claws and painted them back white again. Once the ink was dry, I painted the chest gem with Reaper gem purple, then highlighted it with a little bit of Reaper twilight purple. This guy came out alright. The tufts came out a little like plague sores, but the yeah, that's how it goes sometimes. Keep painting those miniatures, people. <laughs>